हेलो एवरीवन माय नेम इज़ पुरुष एंड वेलकम बैक इन अनदर वीडियो ऑन जस्ट टेक यूट्यूब चैनल सो टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू अ वेरी अमेजिंग मेथड टू डू अनथेटेड बाईपास ऑन योर आईफोन और आईपैड और आईपॉड टच इट्स फुली अनथेटेड मेथड दैट मींस यू कैन इजीली डू रीबूट योर डिवाइस आफ्टर बाईपास नो बोट लूप इशूज नो स्टक ऑन एपल लोगो नो नीड ऑफ सेफ शेड ऑन क्विक और री जेल ब्रेक और री बाईपास अगेन योर डिवाइस आफ्टर रीबूट and it's a completely free method you don't have to pay anything to anyone and it's a windows tool one click windows tool so without wasting time let's get started okay so the first step is you have to restore or flash your device with the latest sign firmware for your device with 3u tool it's a important step you have to follow all the steps carefully otherwise bypass will not work and i already bypassed this device with the free thetted bypass tool but the problem is if i reboot this device after the bypass it will stuck on apple logo and i have to jailbreak it again and bypass it again and do all the process again so this is the thetted bypass and i will show you the unthetted way in which this reboot issue will fix so you can reboot your device easily without getting this boot loop issue so first open the three tools and restore your device now it's in boot loop so i will just disconnect the cable and put into recovery mode by manual method so just hold the home button and insert your cable it may be different with your device so you have to first put your device into recovery mode so as you can see my device in recovery mode now i will open the three tools so just close the itunes Now on 3U tools you will see your device will be connected in recovery mode select go flash and download the latest sign firmware for your device so for my device it is 13.6.1 and 13.6 both are sign so you can use both and if you are on old device like iPhone 5s iPhone 6 that is iOS 12.4.8 so you can flash it so it will take time so i will fast forward the video Now we are done with the restore process. Now the next thing you have to do is you have to jailbreak your device with the Checkrain jailbreak. I have already made the dedicated video on Checkrain jailbreak iOS 13.6.1. So first saw that for the detailed video and I will provide the ISO file link for in the description so you can download it from here. It support iOS 12.2 latest 13.6.1. So first we will jailbreak our device and then we will bypass it. And it's a common process everyone already know how to make a USB bootable so just open Rufus insert the ISO file insert your USB stick and flash it after 2 3 minute it will make your USB stick bootable and then you have to restart your PC and boot the checkrain from it and jailbreak your device.
now after that you have to restart your pc i will not take too much time and check range jailbreak because everyone know how to jailbreak your device if still you are a beginner and don't know much about the check range jailbreak see my detailed video in which i have explained in everything in detail how to jailbreak your device ios 12.2 to 13.6.1 is supported iphone 5s to iphone x and other ipad model that are supported by check range jailbreak so as you can see check range is running now simply disconnect your cable and connect it back and go to your options and allow untested option first it only for the ios 13.5.1 13.6 now you have to put your device into dfu mode so first it will automatically go into recovery mode now follow the steps on the screen now it will go into dfu mode and then your check in jailbreak process will be started so now it's booting and after all done that means your jailbreak is done if you get any error you can try it again because checkrin is still in the beta stage so it may get error sometimes so you have to try it again and it will done so after all done jailbreak just restart your pc and go back to your windows machine and remove your usb stick now we are done with the jailbreak part and restart your device completely now we will move to the bypass part so before that you have to install some dependency it's important for every bypass tool so install python putty net framework and visual c++ so just open google and you will get all this free from the official website i have already installed all this So after installing all this you have to restart your PC to take all the software effect and after that you have to disable your antivirus or if you have a windows defender you can disable that also so it's a important step otherwise this bypass tool will not work so now you have to extract the bypass tool i will give link in the description so just right click on it and extract it After that just open the tool. Now you will see some warning. Just click on okay. And now your bypass tool will automatically load. If still your bypass tool will not open, just install the net framework. It will open. So now as you can see the bypass tool is open. Now you will get all your device detail, iOS version and UDID. If it not appear, just disconnect your cable and connect it back. And it will show you all the details. So in the tool you will get so many options like untethered with SIM pin, no SIM and other delete restore and the update option. So you have to go to the untethered option and you have to click on the start process and then your bypass process will be started so just click on that and if the itunes will open just close it and just click on start process and it will take 20 to 25 seconds to activate your device you can see the progress bar also so just click on that and it will automatically activate your device Now the activating process is started.
and in the process your device will be respring and restart also so don't disconnect your cable after that you will see the activated pop up on your screen so as you can see so just click on ok your device is now activated and unlocked after that you can disconnect your cable now as you can see my device is now fully activated and it's unlocked so now i will show you the checkrin loader is also working now you can install cedia from the checkrin app Now as you can see I am running on iOS 13.6.1 and it's fully untethered you can reboot your device so let me show you so I will just shut down my device and I have not installed any tweak like save shutdown and the other so now as you can see I, it's a untethered bypass it's not getting any boot loop issues or everything is working normally you can reboot your device many times you want without any safe shutdown tweak and the app store is also working so let me just connect with my wi-fi after that just go to your app store and sign up with your apple id or you can create a new apple id also and you can download any apps and games from the app store it's working for me so i will just install any app from showing you so now as you can see it's downloading normally and it's also showing on my home screen so now it's installing so the app store is also working so this is how you can make a untethered bypass on any devices that are supported by checkrin jailbreak it supported both meid and no meid devices so you can easily untethered bypass all these devices that are supported by the checkrin jailbreak and you can reboot your device easily so you don't have to install any tweaks for that and it's working like a normal device so i hope you enjoyed this video if yes then hit the like button and if you're new here subscribe to my channel for more quick updates follow me on all my social media handles all links are in description you can check there so till then keep supporting goodbye take care and peace out